Okay, let's just take a look then at how Group A looks going into this final round of matches. Brazil, you would say, you know, should beat Cameroon. Exciting one, isn't it? Mexico against Croatia. A win for Croatia there through. Meanwhile, three points for Mexico, and it will be them who will be going through to the knockout stages. Yeah, I'd, I'd have to go for Croatia. Number one, because I've got a bet on with Alejandro Maria. <laughs> well. Number two, that I, I think with, with Mexico, I think they've expanded so much energy playing with that three at the back. And the two wide guys have done so much run in those two games. I don't think they can keep the pace up. Croatia, I think, uh, are more methodical with the passing, uh, a bit more accurate, don't take as many chances. So I think Croatia's going to pull through. Dinner on the line. Do Croatia know this? Um, I'm, I don't want to make them too nervous. So I won't let them <laughs> Meanwhile, Jack? I, I think momentum is with the Mexicans. And when I say momentum... You just want to see Stevie Bice. I, I, I do. That, that would be a, a rare sight in itself. But when I talk about the momentum of the Mexicans, keep in mind that this is a team that limped through qualification, had to go through playoffs. I thought started the tournament fantastically well against Cameroon. Moved the ball as quickly as I've seen any Mexican team for, for the last few years. And a good point against Brazil. I feel I, that with that in mind, they've come in with more confidence than the Croatians. They get the point at least that they need.